Hi guys, this is Timo from Jolla Tides here. Um, we've given you a tutorial on how to down uh, download uh, Android apps with the Android app browsers such as One Mobile. Um, uh, you've got AppToid and Yandex and all those kinds of. But um, and there is ways to download obviously from the Jolla Store native Sailfish apps. Um, in this tutorial, we're going to show you actually how to download apps that haven't yet been um, approved for the Jolla Store. Uh, these are native Sailfish apps that haven't been approved yet. Um, to get them early, such as here we've got um, the WhatsApp native version that was downloaded. Um, but in this tutorial, I'll show you how to do that. So, um, so to start with, um, you're going to need to have this file browser, which can be downloaded directly from the Jolla Store. So if we just go into the Jolla Store and you just pull down the pulley menu and search for file browser and there we have it the file browser so what you'd want to do is download that um, and you should see it appear at the bottom of your apps list next we want to go into the native Jolla Sailfish browser I hit that um, and you want to load up the Jolla Tides website and we've recently done an instructional on how to do this very process but it's a written instructional but if you go into that tutorial which can either be found under the how to guide in the top bar there or it's one of the most recent um, posts we've done so it's a tutorial on how to download native beta apps from open repos via the warehouse app. The warehouse app is um, sort of like the some of the Android app browsers, but it's for um, beta native Sailfish apps. So if you zoom into the instructional, you'll see the fir under the first point, um, you, there's a link, and it's um, openrepos.net um, hyphen. Uh, sorry, forward slash content, forward slash basil, forward slash warehouse, hyphen, selfish, OS. So you want to hit that link there. And the page with the most recent versions of the warehouse app will show in this screen and earlier I tried the latest version which was 0.1-3.i586.rpm and that actually didn't work I'd already tried the earlier version and that worked fine so I'd recommend at the moment just to use the version which is um, I'll try and zoom in so you can see it's the first one there it's the harbor-warehouse-0.1-2.rmv 7hl.rpm so when you've got that you want to select that and it should start downloading there we go so you can see there it says downloading and it's downloaded now to access this file and install it you actually need to go into the file browser which um, I told you about earlier so this file browser here which can be downloaded from the Sailfish store the Jolla store uh, then you want to go into downloads and under harbor-warehouse that's the one that you just downloaded so you just select that and then from the pull down menu you just go to install and it says installing installing packages install finished so we come out of there now you should see at the bottom of your apps list an icon for the warehouse app so if we hit on that now we have access to all the beta apps that are available for Sailfish and you can see here there's some re really useful stuff already like the developers that have been working over the holidays to try and get people native apps which we all want of course 
Uh, there's For Sale, that is um, a native Foursquare app, which I've heard good things about. Uh, there's Medard Weather. Um, there's a, a video player here, which I need to try. And there's there's loads. There's Friends, that's a f native Facebook app. Cute Spotify. Uh, Sales Soma, that's a radio app. And then there's WhatsApp, which is Mita Kulu. Um, so there we go. And from here you can manage your native Selfish app. So for instance I've got this WhatsApp installed already. I go on there. Um, it gives you an option to uninstall because it's already installed. But obviously that would be replaced with install if you haven't yet got it. Um, I'm going to try and download... Let's see. I quite like to try the LLS video player. So you have to enable repository. And that's pending at the moment. Actually, while while that's there might be a problem accessing the repository. So I'll just go out of there. I'll do that later. What I'll show you is if you want to remove um, the warehouse app that we just installed. Again, you just go into it and you just hit uninstall there and that will take it off um, and finally if you if you don't need this warehouse app manager which I think is very useful by the way and it makes things a lot easier there is of course the other way to download um, native beta apps um, and that is directly from the open repos um, site itself. So I'll just quickly show you how to download for instance LLS video player that one we are trying to do just now. It might not work if the repository is down but let's try okay there we go LLS video player for Sailfish. Want that one and there we've got the most recent app listings there so we want the point two point uh, hyphen one latest one and that's downloaded that was really quick so again this is the technique if you just want to download from the open repo repos site um, without the warehouse app manager so we've downloaded it now where do you find it well you have to go back to the the file browser and again it would come up under downloads and it would be harbor hyphen something and it would be the video player there so we'll go into that install that's installing install finished 